In this tutorial, we'll take a closer look at the binaural panning and floor reflections features of Spin Tracer. We'll explore how these advanced features can create a more immersive and realistic soundscape. We will first listen to a setting with binaural panning and floor reflections disabled. The Doppler effect is still being calculated equally for the left and right audio channels. Upon activating binaural panning and floor reflections, the experience transforms. Binaural panning adjusts the Doppler effect by considering the sound source's movement and its varying distances for the left and right ear individually. At the same time, the floor reflections feature enhances realism by simulating how sound waves bounce off the floor, adding another layer of sound that travels from the ground to your ears, alongside the direct sound from the object. This effect introduces a natural phasing effect to the audio. We intentionally set the trace's Z height to 20 cm above the floor for this patch, mirroring the typical height of a car's exhaust pipe relative to the ground. Similarly, we adjusted the listener's height in the floor reflection to 1.8 meters, approximating the average ear height. These precise settings create the distinctive phasing effect you recognize when a car zooms past you on the road. Let's listen once more how both features contribute to a richer, more authentic listening experience. First, both features are disabled. And now enabled. Thank you for watching the tutorial. To discover more about SpinTrace's functionality and how it can transform your audio projects, stay tuned for our next tutorial.